Hi YouTube viewers and uh, random survival fans, it's Angle Boyle here. And uh, today I'm actually going to be showing you a bug out bag. Um, it's pretty cool, uh, I use it actually as a luggage bag. Um, but uh, I'm just going to show you what I actually put in it. I changed it um, from a luggage bag to a uh, bug out bag. This is what it looks like, full and full. So, as you saw first, you actually have this little little container. Pop this out. You actually have some bug spray. There's a refillable cans right here. Put that back in there just like that. Clip that on. I actually got this today. It was on clearance. It was awesome. Seven dollars, two dollars. That was pretty cool. As if the, you know, what? let's start smallest to biggest. There's a little front pouch here, and we have some beef jerky sticks and a plastic bag, which you can use that plastic bag. We have, if you're out with a bunch of friends and you get lost, a mini survival kit you can give to one of your friends in case you don't want to give this away. We've got a karambit knife for self-defense just in case you never know. Kind of a cutting knife, you can use that. Matches. And that's all for uh, this little mini pouch, I think. Yes. So let's put these back. It's a pretty cool, small pouch, so uh, pretty cool that I uh, fit all that stuff in there. Um, and then we come into the main pouch. We actually have a plastic baggie. Uh, I think, yeah, this is a, a spare pair of shorts, an extra pair in case, like, one of the pairs gets a wet or something. Then next in here, we have a bottle of water in case I put it in a Powerade bottle. I bought the Powerade the other day um, and uh, it still has the expiration date so the uh, expiration date, why it has an expiration date on this is it's not about the drink going bad, it's actually about the bottle going bad so the water never goes bad. We have a can of Chef Boyardee mini ravioli. Um, we have, oh, I have a extra shirt there. And I've airtighted these um, pretty good. Um, and I have a uh, spare pair of boxers and socks. So I got all of my clothes. And we have a emergency blanket. Uh, I've actually used this before. Um, me and my brother actually kind of share this. Um, so this actually keeps you very warm if you go into shock. Uh, that goes over you to control the body temperature. Um, you could probably hurt someone with this or hurt something. I actually have a uh, pellet gun. Uh, this is actually an aerosoft gun. It'll do something to something. Extra pellets. Um, what else do we have here? We have a kind of rainbow survival knife. Very nice with the saw blade on the end. Look at the uh, compass. It's pretty accurate, actually. Pretty really that's accurate. We got a, a sharpening stone. You can see, I've used that before. To sharpen my knives. Because that's the only one I actually have. Alright, and then we go down a little deeper. I actually have a light straw. I've used this plenty of times. Um, water filtration system and a straw. You can just like stick this into, let's say, a river or something. And uh, water filtration, you just suck on it. And get filtered water. Pretty simple. Cool stuff though. Alright, and then the last thing in here is probably what's taking up the most weight. I actually have a loot crate box, but uh, I use it as a bigger survival kit. And I will actually, I'm not going to go through this with you right now, but in a different video, I will uh, show you what's inside of this. I'll just give you a brief look. And then under this, you get all that stuff, okay? That's just a quick look. Now what's to come in another video? I'll make that. I'll just do that as a miniature or decent-sized survival kit. 
Well, thank you guys for watching. Uh, rate, view, like, and subscribe. Hope you liked it. Peace out, guys.